Dedication I dedicate this book to the glory of my precious Savior, and to my dear wife Lily, and daughter and who have encouraged and inspired me to record these experiences. My sincere thanks also to Mrs. E. Fleming and Mrs. L. DeCamp for the typing and review of the manuscript. Forward I have known the author of this story for more than 15 years and have sat under his ministry at Bethany Bible Chapel in Satellite Beach, Florida. Satellite Beach lies in the shadow of the Great Gantry. I dedicate this book to the glory of my precious Savior, and to my dear wife Lily, and daughter and who have encouraged and inspired me to record these experiences. My sincere thanks also to Mrs. E. Fleming and Mrs. L. DeCamp for the typing and review of the manuscript. Forward. I have known the author of this story for more than 15 years and have sat under his ministry at Bethany Bible Chapel in Satellite Beach, Florida. Satellite Beach lies in the shadow of the great gantries that have placed men in outer space and on the moon. Each time I visit Mr. Snadden it is hard for me to realize a human being could endure such mental and physical torture during those war years, yet remain unscathed. The only reason for this is that Dan Snadden, as a young lad in Scotland, put his soul and life in the hand of the Savior of the world. His faith in the Lord Jesus Christ brought him the courage to persevere under heartbreaking conditions and also was a fortress in the days of adversity. It sustained him during the darkest hours and gave him the assurance of a glorious future. This story is the testimony of a Scottish lad who under adverse circumstances sought to honor God, and God has honored him. The book obviously is not written for self-aggrandizement, but rather for God's glory and to show his ability to sustain his children. Dan Snadden heard the call to full-time service for God in 1959. Then he was led to serve him in a new work at Satellite Beach, near Cape Canaveral. Many souls have been saved under his preaching, and many afflicted believers have found refuge in the perfect hiding place through his ministry. As you read this thrilling story may you be inspired to move closer to the God who is equal to every circumstance. G. Tom Wiley Chairman of the Board National Standard Life Insurance Company, FLA.